Uh, so, my name is Marit Solicic. Uh, I'm a professor of physics at MIT, and I'm also founder of Vitricity. It's a, a company that works on wireless power transfer. Some of my friends were applying to colleges in America, so I thought I would try it. I wasn't so serious and determined to come, but I applied, and uh, MIT said that they would not only accept me, but that they would pay completely and fully for it. So at that point, you know, there was almost like nothing to lose, so I thought, okay, I might as well come for a year. If worse comes to worse, I can come back. But then, you know, like 20 years later, I'm still here. <laughs> Basically, almost overnight, uh, we started using these battery power devices in everyday life, and often you have to remember to recharge them more than once per day. So, as, as a result, the need to find different ways of recharging it emerged almost at night. So, we started thinking about what are the ways that could enable something like this. Then we started thinking about uh, wireless power transfer, so that's what our company does. Here we have a source of electricity. Uh, in this case sitting on a table and then uh, this is like uh, you could call it like a receiver and when I bring it some distance from the source you can see power being transferred wirelessly from source to the device irrespective of the you know orientation of the device you know if I put my hand in, in between it doesn't interrupt it I can uh, bring another device so I can charge two devices at the same time uh, so this is what our company does yeah, things are going really well now, so, you know, the, uh, the company has been growing pretty rapidly, both, as you said, both in terms of investment, in terms of number of employees, so, uh, you know, it's very exciting, you know, like, just to think about it, that, you know, not so many years ago, it was just, like, a theoretical idea, right, and now, uh, you know, like, a thing like this is really working and being, you know, produced mm -hmm. for practical applications. You know, in general, it's not so easy to start a high-tech company outside of America, period, right? There are very few countries where you can have a successful high-tech company, right? And uh, especially for, you know, somebody who just came to the country, right? So there are certainly very few countries where you would have an opportunity like that, right? Uh, it's a welcoming country in terms of opportunities, so you have all the other opportunities that Americans have. And moreover, especially once you have American citizenship, right? We, and, uh, but also socially you have all the other opportunities that uh, other people have, right? You know, it's kind of like the moment you have American citizenship, for them you are an American, right? It's not, it's not you know, in most other countries it depends, you know, where were you born, who were your parents, and, and so on, right? So in America it's much more about, you know, once you have American citizenship, then you're one of them. It's, in that sense, I mean, it's welcoming. It's quite different than in most other countries, right?